Roy Moore just revealed the one Bible verse he relied on to make it through Vicious Campaign. Roy Moore shared a scriptural verse on Tuesday that has sustained him through his challenging campaign for U.S. Senate during an Election Day interview. Moore was asked on Works radio show Alabama's Morning News, how difficult it has been to weather the allegations of sexual misconduct, stemming from the 1970s. The candidate described the allegations as false and malicious political attacks, that he's had to stand against. That is all God asks is to stand, and we've done that. Moore stated. Stand therefore, as it says in Ephesians, he continued, against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of darkness in this present world. Wherefore take ye the whole armor of God. That verse has been a mainstay. Moore was then questioned about his statement at a rally in Dothan, Alabama, on Monday night in which he said people should not vote for him if they could not do so in good conscience. One thing I don't like the media has said is that there are a lot of Republicans that are going to vote for me and just ignore what they believe, the candidate said at the rally. I want to tell you, if you don't believe in my character, don't vote for me. Moore was asked if his words risked people voting against him, citing the reasoning, even the judge says I shouldn't vote for him. No, because I know that I've done nothing wrong replied the West Point graduate. I don't want people to vote against their conscience. I think it's wrong. If I thought somebody did something that was immoral, I wouldn't vote for him. I can't help what they believe, Moore added. They can look at the facts. They can see when these complaints and these allegations came forth. The candidate stated he wanted people to believe in and vote for him based on his 40-year career in public service and willingness to stand for what is morally right even at the cost of his own job. He was twice removed as Chief Justice of the Alabama Supreme Court for his stances on the display of the Ten Commandments at the state's courthouse building, as well as his belief in traditional marriage. Queried whether he is concerned about an ethics investigation should he prevail on Tuesday, Moore responded he was not. It does not concern me because it would be unconstitutional, the judge stated. He explained that not only are the decades-old allegations false, but the Senate only has jurisdiction to investigate alleged wrongdoing while in office. They don't have that jurisdiction to overcome the vote of the people of Alabama, said Moore.